Well, good evening. My name is Jay. I'm here this evening to tell you about my grandson Luke Dietz, who in the next century will be a famous Picasso. The bird, the bird, it's all about the bird, the bird, the bird, it's all about the bird, the bird who had no wings and couldn't fly, sat on the commode and wished he'd cry, whoa, the bird, the bird, it's all about the bird. Who, uh, who is a famous artist who has painted this bird for me, twice as large as the original bird, and uh, this is his brother, and his sister, and his mother, and his dad, who's my son. And uh, it's really all about the bird, really. It's all about the bird, the bird. All about the bird. The initial story of the bird began in the Republic of Panama, up in the mountains in a little town called Volcan, in a little bar in a Volcan. We were up there one Easter celebrating Easter, Easter week, which we always did. And uh, the bird was discovered in the jungles. And the uh, bartender, who was, happened to be a painter also, was, had this uh, bird uh, on the wall behind the bar. And it reminded us of our good friend, Dave Moffat. Because Dave looked a lot like the bird. And so we thought we would uh, see if we could get a painting of the bird because we thought it was one of the greatest things that we had ever saw. And uh, my grandson Luke fell in love with this bird, which I had hanging in my bathroom to remind me of so much of Moffat. And uh, he wanted it so bad that I gave it to him on his graduation from somewhere. <clears throat> and in turn, he has made the bird number two and has given it to me to hang on my wall in my bathroom. And uh, so the moral of the story is, if you're having trouble go to the bathroom, buy this bird. Buy this bird, buy this bird, buy this bird. Look in the camera. Hi.